Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora, News and Rumors The upcoming game Avatar, The Frontiers of Pandora is set to be a main facet of the impending revival of the iconic franchise. While past games under the IP have been created and have been relatively well received, this impending title promises to be the most holistic and expansive gaming representation of Pandora to date. Originally announced at E3 2021, Avatar, The Frontiers of Pandora is set to be published by video game giant Ubisoft and is aiming for a 2022 release date. With this release date potentially being relatively close, there is plenty of information regarding the title that fans can already explore. James Cameron shares his thoughts on Frontiers of Pandora. James Cameron has revealed his thoughts on Ubisoft's upcoming game during an IGN interview. Confirming he's taking a hands-off approach, he explained. We're very excited about what Ubisoft is doing with their game authoring. I don't tell them what to do, they know their world, their business, their market. We just keep a close eye that they don't do anything that's not canonical in terms of Nasik's culture and what the RDA is doing on Pandora and all that sort of thing. Studio Boss Departs Ubisoft Massive Studio Head, David Paulfelt, has confirmed that he is leaving the studio later this year, after 17 years there. Previously, Paulfelt had taken a step back from his managing director role stating an intention to return in a strategic role after a six-month break. However, it has now been reported that he will be leaving Ubisoft entirely. Paul Felt's decision is partly driven by the growing numbers of staff at Ubisoft Massive, telling hit points, I think my philosophy and my skills work well for a certain kind of group of a certain kind of size. I don't think I'm the right manager for what the studio has become. I'm perfectly at peace with it. Between the development of Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora, and the open-world Star Wars project the studio is working on, it's no surprise that it's expanding rapidly. Years of post-launch content Ubisoft is planning a long life for Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora, when it releases next year it seems. In a recent Q2 earnings call, Ubisoft CFO Frederick Deguet said, Avatar Frontiers of Pandora is a big game next to the highly awaited movie. The development is progressing well and is a beautiful world delivered by the Snowdrop engine. That will be a very long game in terms of content delivered over many years. Avatar Frontiers of Pandora Story There's not much known about Avatar Frontier of Pandora's narrative. When the game was originally announced, no footage or information regarding a theme or tone was revealed. Fans began to theorize that the game and Avatar 2 film would correlate, with some sort of story connection bridging the two. It's still possible that both will share a promotion run, or be released at around the same time. However, Ubisoft's website claims that the game will take players throughout the western frontier, which is a never-before-seen part of Pandora. This website also claims that it will be a living and reactive world inhabited by unique creatures and new characters. It also refers to the game as a standalone story, which probably means it won't be tied to the second film in a significant way. It's even possible that players will be able to create their own character, as our character is simply referred to as a Nasix rather than given a specific name. Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora Release Date Initially, Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora was due out sometime before the end of Ubisoft's fiscal year, which ends on March 31, 2023. But during a Ubisoft earnings call in July, the publisher confirmed it would be pushing the release until the next fiscal year, which falls between April 1, 2023 and March 31, 2024. It's a large window but expect it to drop sometime within that year range. Ubisoft wants to make Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora, the start of its own video game brand, so the company wants it to be perfect according to CEO Eve Guillemont during a conference call. The potential is just enormous. There are also lots of movies coming and lots of activity on that brand in the next few years. We are treating that brand like a video game brand, so we are putting all the energy of the team to make sure it is a fantastic game. 
Unlike Far Cry 6, however, Ubisoft's Avatar title won't be released on PS4 or Xbox One. Instead, on a rare commitment to making a truly next-gen experience, Ubisoft has revealed that Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora will launch on PS5, PC, Xbox Series X/S, Stadia, and Amazon's upcoming Luna Cloud service.